I'm gonna pull this open. Hi, Maddie. I'm coaching with Maddie tonight, so that'll be fun. Um, so for those of you who are watching later and wondering who I'm talking to, um, I'm recording this into my team's testimonial group, Welcome Wellness. Um, we use it to encourage people along their non-toxic journey. Um, it's where we usually put customer specials and all of that kind of goodies, all of those kind of goodies. First, we also try to add a lot of value with bringing in outside experts and sharing on other topics about wellness, not just Pure Haven. So if you are interested, let me know. I can add you to that group. Um, so I am streaming live there and recording this because I want to pop this into a few groups where I have things going on, um, parties and all also my own group. Um, thank you, Batty. She said my hair looks so healthy and shiny. Um, so I popped on today because um, I was one, I am in the top 20 or 30 um, people so far trending for the trip to Cancun. I have a few people on my team who have already earned it, which I'm super excited about for them. Um, but because I'm in that ranking, they sent me the new products to try first. So um, I just wanted to share this deodorant, you guys, if you do not like the peppermint smell of the other deodorant, most people love it. But I've had some people who are like, oh, I don't like peppermint. This is amazing. Definitely stock up on this. Um, it's citrus and sage. Um, and it has sage and chamomile in it. And it, it just smells, it smells amazing. You guys, you really want this deodorant. So if you are not, if you're not big on, um, on, uh, peppermint, this is really nice citrus and sagey smell. It's not at all, um, pepperminty. You don't get any of that peppermint smell that hits you. Um, now with with our regular deodorant, I always tell people, if you don't like, if you don't want to smell like mint chocolate chip ice cream all day, which is what I kind of think it smells like, don't worry, the smell dissipates. So I tell people, if you love mint chocolate chip ice cream, you're going to love our deodorant. If you hate mint chocolate chip ice cream, you're also going to love our deodorant because the smell dissipates. So um, definitely if you are a fan of citrus and sage, check this out. Hi, Maria. Yeah, the specials email, super exciting. Um, yes, this, so this is coming out in honor of Father's Day, but you guys, it really does not smell manly. It just doesn't smell like our other deodorant. It smells more citrusy. It's really lovely. So I would definitely recommend it. So our second product that I want to highlight and same scent. And I love that you get a little bit of that sage, um, citrus sage body wash and shampoo, um, aloe sage and marigold is in this. So here's the deal. We have come out before with like men's lines with like different stuff. So like a face wash and a face oil and that kind of thing. A lot of guys, my husband actually has started using the skincare line. If you come to one of our Zooms, you will know that because he's on our Zooms. He does the drawings for our Zooms and um, he will tell you that he did not use anything to wash his face with until he tried the skincare. So he could talk a little bit more about it, but he definitely, um, is one of those guys who likes as few like steps as possible. So you may realize that our baby wash and baby shampoo, um, they're a, a one and done, right? Like you just need to, you're like, both of them are mixed together. You use the shampoo and the body wash. This is a similar type of thing. So for guys who are like, I just need one thing. I don't need like a whole bunch of things. They can wash their whole body and wash their hair with this um, two-in-one product. So it's amazing. It smells awesome. Sometimes our, um, when we've come out with men's lines, a few of the things that I've, one of the things that I've heard about our men's lines in the past is that they are kind of, um, they're so heavy on the cedar wood that they're very manly. This is not manly, but it's not girly either. It definitely says, reads very citrusy to me. Um, when you smell it, um, and you just get that little hint of sage. I don't know about you guys, but I love sage. I hardly ever use it when I cook though. I use it like just at Thanksgiving. So I get like my, my 
parsley, sage, rosemary, and thyme <laughs> at Thanksgiving. I use a ton of rosemary and thyme at Thanksgiving, but for the like for the turkey, when I put in the turkey and the stuffing and everything, I put some sage in it. And so sage makes me think like, I don't know, folly smell. I don't know why, you know, just sort of autumn smell. So um Nancy said she ordered hers first thing this morning. Um, so this product I really want to talk to you guys about. So this is called Shave Butter. So something about shave butter, first of all, um, there's, if you're not familiar with shave butter and the reason that men prefer, or some men prefer shave butter, if they're really into shaving, um, and they like getting like a clean line with like, maybe they're doing some kind of like, you know, they have like a really low cut close to their face beard and they try to like trim it and make it like nice and straight, you can see the lines more easily with a shave butter than with a shave gel or a shave, like something that foams. So it really helps you with making sure that your lines are nice and clean when you're shaving, when you're a guy. So I, you know, I'm not a shave butter kind of person. I will probably use this because we have it, or actually I'll probably give it to my son who is 17. He would really like to grow facial hair, but he unfortunately has my husband's genetics for growing facial hair. And my husband, um, cannot grow facial hair. So, um, Aiden's facial hair looks very thin. He's been like actually rooting up um, it's a really nice texture. I'm not sure if you can see that, but it just gives a really nice like glide when you're shaving um, without foaming up a lot. Um, so it lets the razor slide over it nice and smooth. And again, that really nice sort of little hint of sage scent without being overwhelming, but mostly citrus. Um, so anyway, yeah, my poor son has. Um, does not much like, like my husband cannot grow facial hair and <laughs> very well. It doesn't come in thick. Like it's not a natural thing for him. Um, so he was reading up on like how to grow thicker facial hair. And one of the things he read was to re to eat spinach. So I'm very excited about this because he really wants to grow facial hair. So he thinks that maybe if he eats more leafy greens, he'll be able to grow more facial hair. So I'm very excited about that development in our lives right now. Um, Jenny said she got her um, new products ordered first thing this morning. Yay, Jenny. All right. So yeah, I mean, this just, it the shea butter just feels amazing. So you don't need very much. It's more eco-friendly um, is what I read. I think because it doesn't have the foaming agents in it. Um, and also you don't need any kind of propellant in it to get it to, you know, it's just a little bit more eco-friendly than shaving, um, than the shave creams that come out of a can. Um, and it's easier, you get enough of a slot glide that it actually works really well to, for the razor to go over. Um, but, you know, it doesn't, you don't have to work at it like with a brush and soap. Um, so just some thoughts for you guys um, on Father's Day gifting or just to stock up um, or, and for, like I said, this, this deodorant, if you're not a fan of peppermint, you're going to love this deodorant. All right. Next new product. So I did not get the facial moisturizer with SPF, but I'm super excited about it, you guys, because you know, we, I get all the time. Well, what do I use on my face from my clients, from my customers saying, what do I use on my face? So the moist, the, um, face lotion with SPF, I am so excited for it. I have not gotten that one yet. So here's what happened. They had it all set to release for us. Um, like they had scheduled it to re release for us at leadership. And then they had, um, issues with getting it done in time. So we are getting it now. Um, so it's in time for summer. Um, so please, please, please take a look at that. I'm really excited about it. Um, yeah, Chris, I am super excited about the sunscreen too. So as you can tell, I'm super fair. 
<laughs> burn easily. I love our sunscreen, but it's a little heavy for your face. Um, one of the tips that I heard from a consultant on my team, she actually mixes our regular sunscreen with her moisturizer and some beauty booster. Now, if you don't have our regular face moisturizer and our beauty booster on hand, that's really spendy. Like if you're not committed to switching over your skincare yet, and you're not using our beauty booster already, that's an expensive fix to getting it to be the right consistency. I love that fix um, for me because I have, I use the beauty booster regularly. I use our moisturizer regularly. So it makes a lot of sense, but for somebody who's just looking for a good moisturizer with SPF, it's expensive to do that as a fix. So this seems like a great option. I am super excited about it as well. So I wanted to pop on here today and share a little bit with you guys about what we had that's new um, and make sure you knew about everything and to give you some like personal testimonials on things and they smell amazing. You guys are gonna fall in love, fall in love. I hope they keep this. I really. I really hope that we got amazing reviews and I'm tell you guys this here, um, customer service really, really listens to feedback from consultants and customers. That's why the headache stick is here for good now. Thank goodness. Because, um, for those of you who know Anissa on my team, she bought like five of them before it went out of stock because she was like, what am I going to do without this in my life until it comes back? And so, um, anyway, for those who do not like the peppermint deodorant, this is an awesome, awesome fix. I already am thinking of people that I can call and say, we have deodorant that's citrus and not pepperminty. So yeah, you guys are going to love this. All right. So anyway, I'm just going to check and see if there's any more questions. Yeah. I hope it's permanent too. Cause there are a lot of people. I also feel that way about our bug spray, right? There are people who need bug spray year round. So I'm hoping that, um, this, that the deodorant and the moisturizer with SPF become permanent. So if you fall in love with these products, let the home office know that you or your consultant, um, know that you are absolutely in love with these products. Can't live without them. And if you give the company that feedback and that they, they know there are going to be people who are buying these things regularly, they're much more likely to keep them. So anyway, have a great day, everybody. Take care. Bye-bye.